Good morning. Today we're reflecting on Psalm 112. Psalm 112 describes the blessed state of the righteous. And I believe the key to unlocking the entire service in the very first verse. And it reads, Praise the Lord. Blessed is the man who fears the Lord, who finds great delight in his commands. So right at the outset, we're told how the blessing comes. It comes to those who fear God and those who delight in his word. Often the Bible tells us not to fear, but it also tells us that we should only fear God. The fear described here is a reverential fear. It is a fear not just of his power and of his righteous judgment, but is a wholesome fear of displeasing God. It is this fear that influences our disposition and attitude and governs our life. The other thing that was talked about is a delight in God's word, and this is echoed in Psalm 1. In his expanded form, and is the very instruction God gave Joshua after the death of Moses. In Joshua 1 8, he says, This book of the law shall not depart out of your mouth, but you shall meditate in it day and night, that you may observe to do all that is written in it, for then you will make your way prosperous, and then you will have good success. In other words, as we delight in God's word, we read his word, we we'll think on it over and over and over again until it becomes our predominant thought. This then translates to corresponding action or obedience, and this is what transforms and brings the blessing. The rest of the psalm then lists the blessings. It includes wealth, security, honor, influence. The righteous is not only blessed, but becomes a blessing to future generations. Let us be a people who fear God and people who delight in his word. Have a great day.